Good, and good, and good. Almost good. Hello, guys. Hey, guys. 17 years. Oh, my gosh. 17 years. Anniversary dinner. Jamie and, and I have been together for 17 years. What? Holy crap. <laughs> you know, instead of... um. Holy crap. Instead of going out to like a fancy dinner, why not just eat our favorites, our favorite dinner together, right? It makes more sense that way. We tried going out, but it just wasn't going to work. It so probably next work. week. Most likely next week, if I had to guess. Water? I'll get it. I got to do my shake anyway. <clears throat> Is that what he wants? Water? Or yeah, he wants water. That's why he scratches his bowl. Oh my gosh. Guys, it's so crazy. Hello, Abby. Thank you. Happy anniversary. Thank you very much, Abby. Yes. 17 years. That's a long ass time. <laughs> That's a long time to be with somebody. And honestly, it's crazy. It doesn't really feel like 17 years to me. It really doesn't feel like 17 years. It feels like 17 years for me. <laughs> Well, you can hey, Tracy. bite me. <laughs> Didn't say that was a bad thing. Right before we went on. It really doesn't on, feel like 17 years, though. So I said this in my running video tonight. I said 17-year anniversary. We're doing pizza and tacos. And then I ended the video by saying 17 long years. I'm running. Right? I didn't mean that as a, oh my god, 17 years. I just said it. And someone said, you don't seem too thrilled about it. <laughs> you don't seem very thrilled <laughs> You really don't. Oh, thank, thank you, Jennifer. Thank you, Vanessa. Thank you, Vanessa. Thank you, Jennifer. Macho time. Uh -huh. Yeah. Thank you, Melanie. Your tacos look amazing. Thank you. They're, I think they're going to be amazing. Hopefully, they won't be soggy. I don't think they're going to be soggy. Pizza again. Mm. Yeah, Jimmy. We'll see. Want a slice? Pizza again. Well, how about happy anniversary, Kathy and Jamie? How about that, Jimmy? Here's what happened. Me and Kat went to the store tonight and we picked out our dinners. I was going to do a crunch wrap variation, right? I'm going to do that tomorrow. And then around like 8 o'clock, 8.15, I'm like, okay, I think, uh, I think I'm just going to do pizza. I felt pizza. like I didn't get to enjoy it to the extent last night because I did 108 minutes live last night. And by the time I got to the, like the last three slices, it was cold. I still finished it for the most part, with the exception of the crust left over. But um, I don't know. I think what I'm going to start doing, if I run into this predicament again, I'm going to start having the little toaster oven right here, so I could just heat it up as I'm talking. <laughs> That'd be fun if you could do that. I can do it. I have an outlet right here. Yeah, and you then just I can do it burn right... the floor. No, I put it on the on the ta on the um, chair. Oh, burn your mom's chair. No, sure. Put it on. Put something else as like a thing. You want a taco? You want a taco? Uh, I don't know. If I'll have one left. I might. I don't know. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you very much, girl. I appreciate that. You ready to dig in, Chico? Oh hell yes. I freaking woke up with like a cold, and this shit sucks. Yeah, and it's cold on it's Long Island. It's freaking cold now. And I woke up with a cold, and I don't feel very good. My throat's sore. My nose is stuffed. I'm not a fan Let's of see. all this crap that's go. going on. Thank you, Lisa Marie. Do you only eat once a day? Yes. Normally, yes. Not all the time. Like, I had the cookie corner experience last night. But then when I woke up, I haven't eaten anything since. So, I haven't eaten since... Took Kaki to work at like six o'clock this morning. Yeah. yeah, my butt had to be at, to work at six, and I will tell you right now, I freaking fell into my into my freaking sushi coma. Thank you, Kate. And that was like the best sleep I've had in a really long time. <laughs> I can't tell you that was like the best sleep I've had in a really long time. I that didn't... sushi coma was amazing. She was in such a coma oh that I asked her. I said, "You drank, didn't you, at dinner?" She's like, I'm not drunk. I just, this sushi. I didn't even me. drink. I know. I didn't even drink at dinner. I didn't even drink yesterday. I had no wine, no that's nothing how, yesterday. That's how much of an effect the sushi had. Yeah. On he was just like, you drank, didn't you? And I was like, no. I did not drink. I swear to God. Uh, thank you, Kate. I did not drink. 
But uh, I, tonight, did I drink? Yes. Yes, I did. Tapatio. Gotta have the tapatio with the tacos. It's not a taco without tapatio. Thank you, Snow White. Lucky beat it. You're not on my uh, my happy list. Get out of here. Oh, thank you, Snow White. I love your name, by the way. Tapatio is the best. Yes, it is. I disagree. I think Frank's Red Hot Sauce is the best. No, a taco. Mm -mm. Too many carbs and white rice on sushi? Question mark, question mark. I don't know. Hello, Monica. Well. Yucky pizza, you're funny. I don't really care about carbs on, on, on the rice and sushi. I didn't really have sushi, honestly. Why don't you tell I, everybody what you ate? You didn't even tell me. I ate mostly tempura shrimp. I ate like those little fried dumpling things. I had teriyaki beef, teriyaki chicken, teriyaki shrimp, Thank fried you. rice. Yeah, Crustless Pizza tonight. King fried season. wontons. I went all out. <laughs> I ate all the fried stuff that puts your butt to bed. Yeah, I ate all of it. All the fried stuff that makes you go night night. Um, Kagi was so out of it. I think uh, she went to bed. She actually walked upstairs right before I went on. And then. You woke me up. And then you're like, are you hungry? I was like, no, I'm not hungry. I didn't wake up. I yeah. went to get the tripod. You were looking at me. I said, you all right? Yeah. I'm like, you hungry? You're like, no. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was like, no, I'm not hungry. <laughs> Thank you, Lee. And then I just went up to bed. Happy yeah. anniversary. Thank you very much. Do you How many tacos? tacos? I don't know. Six? Seven? I don't know. Seven. I'm going to make a bet right now. She does not eat them all. You can look at me all you want, but you won't eat them all. I'm going to go and say you'll eat five. Those tacos are stacked. Honestly, oh, well, I'm jealous. These tacos are stacked. There's mostly lettuce in here. <laughs> I put lettuce down first only because I didn't want them getting soggy. Oh, you son of a biscuit. You would eat ten? I've eaten the whole 18 pack before. Pretty sure. I've uh, I've done damage on tacos. Kaki makes the best tacos. Like I can't compete with her tacos. And when uh, she gives me a bite or two, Jimmy said, "I bet she does." I bet you she doesn't. Jamie, I made a BLT wrap with lavish bread. Romaine lettuce, pepper jack cheese, garden tomatoes, mayonnaise, low sodium, farmland bacon. Then I heat it up a little salsa. Add to it. Wow. I don't think I've ever done salsa on BLT. Hey, Mr. Savvy. Monica, I love tacos. Me too, girl. You guys hear the crunches? Me too, Me too, Monica. I love tacos. Uh, what the hell was I gonna say? I had something I wanted to. No, if you're gonna beg, you love a woman we can't be friends tonight. Well, if you love, a, I love to eat tacos. Jamie, are you Jamie? You're eating your favorite food. Are you having a cookies after the stream? Yeah, there's a cookie pie. No ice cream on it yet, but there will be. Cookie pie was uh, absolutely delicious last night. I love al pastor you tacos. Me. Specifically, I don't even know what those are. Monica, do you want to tell me what those are? All right, jail for you, because you're hurting me. Oh, Lucky's going to jail. He's <laughs> going to jail. You guys can see him. It's like he's got the bars. <laughs> I've been locked up, can't let me out. What's up, Johnny Bees? Everybody was saying I was in such a good mood last night. And they're like, why are you in such a good mood? I said, my girlfriend's not here. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh that's so nice, considering I'm not your girlfriend. Mm -mm. I was joking I said that, too. <laughs> they marinated porky, so bomb. 
Jeez. God tells it how it is sometimes, you know. But I have fun with it. I always have fun. I can make a joke go out of just about hey, anything. Hey, Johnny And whenever Khaki's not with me, I always joke with either she left me for Tyrone or Miguel down the street or the mechanic. It's, it's always something. It's always something. You got to have a good... Uh, a good um, No, Abby, I do laugh. not have a dessert. I don't have a dessert. Mm -mm. Actually... I'm lying, because tonight was our sister-in-law's birthday, uh -huh. so I do have her cake back there. Yeah, I did. But have I did a cut piece. myself a piece of. Through so. the years. Oh, thank you. I admire the both of you. Great content through the years. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you very much. Appreciate that. Yeah, I um, you know. So here's what I'll say about my content. I'm still doing the food videos, right? Uh, I'm still going to be doing the running. But I want to do more of letting more of me because it seems like the most interesting part about me is the stuff that you guys see that I never, I never like try to put attention to it. And then it always gets brought up in questions. And I think I'm just going to start letting more of the me person out, whether it's talking and explaining why I do certain things, maybe some cookie corner content like in the room. Uh, just talking content. I don't know. I got a, I got like a bunch of ideas in my head. Just don't know how to put them together. I might just <laughs> let them out and fly <laughs> and see what happens. Freaking Tyrone tried to steal khaki again. Dang it. Abby. What the hell is that? Tyrone. Your special little getaways. I told them all about it last night. Why am I so puzzled? <laughs> it's a joke. It's a joke. <laughs> Past no one mentioned sushi tonight. Sorry, Kaki. Kaki, he seemed so lonely last night without you. Nah. I'm always lonely without her. She's my Garth to my Wayne. Right? He We're probably was lonely. Um, oh, they probably passed jokes where he wasn't. Oh, I'm not missing her. Jimmy Jam was here with me. Abby was here with me. Portland was here with me. A lot of you guys were here with me. And I said, I said, guys, if you guys could keep me company, keep the questions coming, keep this entertaining for, for, for it not to be just boring, I'll stay. I'll stay as long as I finish the pizza. And I finished the, the, pretty much the whole pizza. What's up, the soap fetch? Off the pizza talk last night. Yeah, windows <laughs> open, John. You're talking about the, uh, our windows are open. I shut these two. What's up, Mr. Jimmy Hello, Jam? Hello, Jimmy Jam. It isn't the liver <laughs> king and his part-time pruno queen. Yes, thank you for joining us. But I disagree. Happy anniversary to all those around you that have had to put up with your beautiful love. LOL. Aw, thank you, Jimmy Jam. Thanks, buddy. Mwah. Thank you, Jimmy Jam. We appreciate that. Thank you very much. Is it an actual anniversary? Happy, happy um, if it is. Yeah, 17 years, Cassandra. 17 years we've been together. Yes, it is an actual anniversary. September is a month full of anniversaries. No, it's a fake anniversary. <laughs> September is when I first started YouTube and social media. September is when me and Khaki had our, uh, you know, first together, like our date. September was the September 14th was my first wrestling match ever. Oh, happy birthday to your daughter, Johnny Bees. Happy seventh to your daughter. That's awesome. Happy birthday. Jamie and Kat, for your anniversary, I'm sending you big nudies. Big it's, nudies? It's the gift it's that, keeps, gift on that keeps on giving. Well, hell yes, Jimmy Jam. I'm hoping for that one. <laughs> I always like a good nude. It depends on the nude. <laughs> mm -mm. Sometimes when someone would send like a video and there's noise to it, the proper thing to do is, hey, don't have the sound if you're around somebody in public. And then you open it, and it's mm -hmm. like. Mm 
Yes, I understand that. <laughs> no, I haven't seen Liver King. His retina detached in one of his eyes? Oh, shit. Uh, I wouldn't believe that. What does that mean? He's going blind. He might be. I would research it before you before you do anything on that. What am I gonna do? It's the Liver King. I'm not friends with him. He don't. He don't. Well, I'm just saying. Like he don't talk some to people me. say things just to say things. Uh. It would be cool if I had the Liver King here when Kaki decided to take the night off. He could eat his cow balls and I could Hit eat my play. pizza. Hit play right now. All right, hold on, Jimmy Jam. Listen, I don't wish anything bad about the Liver King. I, I, I don't know if I can hear the sound right now, Jimmy I like Jam. the Liver King. Jamie is funny. Thank you very much. I can't hear the sound right now. When she asked, what do you bring to the table? <laughs> That's a big penis. I don't need the sound for that. <laughs> he hit his head and got serious injury. He showed oh his my God. pupils Jimmy even Jam. for different sizes. Oh, Jam, you're an EMT? Well, I hope he, I hope he's better. Mr. Jimmy Jam. <laughs> Bro, you the man. Fire, fire. I love your content. Thank you very much. Oh. <laughs> Appreciate it, guys. And then, right, <laughs> hey, right before that, someone said you guys are so lame or slow, something oh. like that. Oh, yeah? Oh, well, then you can just leave. No. We're not obligating you to What'd stay you here. I was watching something Jimmy Jam said. Uh, is your background a green screen? No, every. No, it's a real background. See that pink light right there? I could get up and move it. If you don't believe me, I'll do it right now. Dare me to do it. I'll bring the dream to you. You dare Hello, me. Hello, Willie Mac. Hello, ADH Queen. Now I'm gonna do it. Monica. I set I put this set together every single night. What did I say? That one? That one? She said, I believe you, homie. We believe you. You guys are so adorable. Thanks for continuing the tradition. Well, thank you for staying here and watching us. We appreciate that. Brought the dream to you. See, I told you I'd do it. <laughs> well, there you go. I love the sound of a good exhaust system, but as I've gotten older, I hate these motorcycle opening up the past. In the house, wherever I'm at, yeah. Listen, I don't like the sound of motorcycles going past the house. I don't like it. No, back to jail. Beat it, pal. Listen, sometimes because... Hello, beautiful spirit. How you doing? There was an idea for this eventually to become a green screen when we moved. Yeah. And I like the authentic part about it being an actual set. It feels. It actually feels like it's my own, our own show. Not just us sitting in front of a, a green screen, you know? Ankle is healing nicely. Well, I hope so. I'm not sure which ankle you're talking about, Jimmy Jam, but I'm hoping it's healing nicely. <laughs> what, the, the wiener ankle, Jimmy? <laughs> I don't know. That's why I said I don't know which ankle he's talking about. But I hope it's healing spirit? nicely. Oh, she likes Tapatio. That's good. I love Tapatio. I resemble your weight loss story so much. You're an inspiration. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. I appreciate any of you guys that think I'm an inspiration. Some people think I'm full of shit. You know who you are. Mm-hmm. I know who they are, too. Leave it, I leave it there. I leave it there. Hello, my MILF. How you doing, girl? Happy anniversary to my sweet friends. Cheers, my MILF. Dealing with another year of Jimmy's shit. We'll see about that one. <laughs> so far, so good. But the year is young. <laughs> no, it's not. Thank you, my milk. What do you mean? We're about to end 2023. First of all, we just entered our 17th year of being together, so the year is young. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We'll see. 
Are we going to be sitting here together saying, hey, happy 18-year anniversary? Or is Khaki going to be on an episode of Snapped and Jamie might be just missing? Or Khaki's... We just don't know. We just don't know. Or Khaki's not here and I changed it into a, 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 a buddy thing. <laughs> dun, dun, or dun, Jamie's dun. on an episode of Snapped. <laughs> We'll see. Who knows? We might not be sitting exactly where we are sitting this time next year. Well, Running helped you lose 80 pounds down from 23? Well, congratulations. Yeah, I wasn't running when I first started losing weight. I was counting my calories and then acting like I knew what I was doing in the gym, but I had no clue. 235 to 165. Oh, wow. So you got down two pounds lower than me. I got down to 167. But I started at 300. 297. Yeah, you're basically 300 pounds. Basically 300 pounds. Hello, Munchkin. Jamie, you knew I had to get you back? I know. Laughter is the key. I think so too. I think laughter is the key. Yeah, I have nothing without laughter. Guys, if I didn't make Kaki laugh over these last 17 years, she would have left me a long time ago. I'm almost positive that. I'm very confident that. I'm like 100% positive on that. I'm late to the stream. What's for dinner? Pizza and tacos. 165 below. Despite that the fact go. that I love Jamie. She would have been gone probably year two. I love Jamie. I do. Year two. <laughs> and if she did stick around, probably year 10, she probably would have been like, all right, this motherfucker is just not going to grow up. <laughs> I'm out. Well, you still haven't grown up, but yet I'm still here. <laughs> yeah, You're still the same that. person. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> A lot of women in your shoes, Kathy. And now, hey. we have a beautiful family together. Yeah, so. but a lot of women in your shoes would have left my ass a long time ago. Kagi's like, she's in for it. She's like, in, in, like, she's in all the way. You two really compliment one another? Thank, Thank you, you, Mr. Savvy. We appreciate that compliment. Thank you very much. I'm a, I'm a lot to deal with. I'm not, I'm not saying I'm like a walk in the park. I'm a lot to deal with. And I can't say that I'm not a lot to deal with, because I know I am. Uh, yeah, but... We're both a lot to deal with. Yeah. <laughs> We're both... We both have our... Our... Our uh, shitty qualities. How, yeah, how do we say that? We both have our... Our shitty qualities, perfect. I wouldn't say shitty qualities. We both have our... They're not shitty. They're just... We just have our... I don't know how to explain it. Never mind. I don't know how to explain it. I wouldn't say shitty qualities. Yeah, we just have our differences. Jimmy Jam said it. Faults. Yeah, faults. Yeah, faults. we have faults. Faws. Yeah, 100% faults. Mm -hmm. Kaki, you look beautiful in all the anniversary pictures. Oh, you Who didn't the see the video. Who said that? Uh, Tracy, I think. I, sent, I made a video. Oh. Okay. I didn't tag you in it because you're never on social media, so. Well, thank you. Any single guy friends for me? Nope, not for you. No. I have Jimmy Jam. He's in Chicago. He's married. He's married. Nope. No single friends. Um. I got Cortland, who I don't think he's mm. looking to get into a relationship right Court's now. Cortland's not looking for love right now. Who else do I have? I got brother Joe, but he's married to your yeah, beautiful sister. Yeah, he's married sister. to my sister. No, no singles. Nope. I'm coming from 300 pounds, LOL. 315 the highest. Well, congratulations on the weight loss, man. You gotta start somewhere, right? You don't just start at a high weight and then, boom, 
you're done down 100 pounds in a month, you know? It takes a while, and for a lot of people, it's a, it's a seesaw. You lose a couple pounds, you gain a couple pounds. You get into a rut, you get really motivated. The point is, you gotta stick with it, you know? You gotta trust the process, you know? Just because the scale's not always telling you the number you wanna see, doesn't mean you're not still getting the work done, you know? Clothes will start to fit a little bit better. Uh, that's a big sign. And as long as you're staying, uh, you're c staying committed to it, you'll be all right. Just give it time. Mm. Happy anniversary today, right? Yeah, today. Thank you, Christine. And my mouth, that sounds delicious. Like, for me, weight loss is not, because I know how to do it, it's not hard anymore. The hard part is what I'm currently wanting to embark on. Because I've got a new person that I'm, uh, I'm really digging. I'm really liking him. He's a bodybuilder. And I've been getting into the bodybuilding for the last like two years. But no one has come close to making me want to actually start lifting the weights. I just don't want to go to the gym to do it. I want to do it home. I don't want to do my own kind of uh, routine. Thank I started you, my journey in January of 2022. So you're barking on two years? Two years you're going on uh, starting the journey? So you're on and off of it. Sometimes it takes people a long time. Mm hmm Donuts in the morning is hard to talk Donuts anytime is hard to turn down. That's not easy. And that's why you don't turn them down. You enjoy them. You just don't overdo them. If you give yourself some like leeway to have some fun with your diet, you're not going to fall apart. But you got to remember, you can't do it every day. You know, there's got to be some sort of... Uh, <clears throat> Uh, balance. Did she make all that food? She made her tacos. I made my tacos. And then my pizza is from a pizza place. Tracy, I got over 200 pounds with my first baby. I ate every craving. Okay, Tracy, this is where you and I are going to relate, girl. Because with my first pregnancy, I ate everything. I ate everything. Everything under the damn sun. I ate so, it. Well, I ate ice cream, I ate pizza, I ate it all. I ate every single thing. I don't remember your cravings. Oh my god. Either one of them. My cravings with my son, I gained so much weight. Because I didn't understand, like, nutrition. I didn't understand any of it. And I ate everything. Every, I, I ate all of it. And, like, I had a nutritionist at the time when I was lying there. But then she would sit there and talk about freaking McDonald's Shamrock Shakes. No. And like all the things she would eat from McDonald's with me. And Who's like, this? My nutritionist. Did I ever meet them? No, you never met her. But she was like the worst person I could have ever met in my entire life. But she would literally talk about all the things that I couldn't eat. And then like, then I would crave it and I would eat it. It was horrible. Completely horrible. When I had our daughter, I had lost a bunch of weight prior to having our daughter and I was way more conscious about it and I was obsessing over every single calorie that went into my body to the point where to the day she was born like I would only eat 300 extra calories a day it was bad it was bad like I obsessed over it to the point where I didn't no break more so. I did not break 200 pounds with my daughter because when I had my son, I was like 226 pounds <laughs> and yeah. he wasn't even full term. He wasn't even full term. He was 37, he was 37 weeks when they induced me with yeah. him. I would have easily gained another 20 pounds with him. Easily. Nope. I was way more conscious the second time around. 
way more conscious. Melissa, I've I've tried to get her to do cooking. She used to post her food, like pictures. Get down, get down. But she doesn't even do that anymore. She does. She's not into it, and she doesn't want to be on camera unless she, we're actually doing the show. Yeah, I'm not, I used to do it all the time. I used to post pictures all the time. I used to take pride in my food. I haven't taken pride in my food in a while. No, you still take pride. You just don't care to share it. No, I don't. I, honestly, I really don't take pride in my food like I used to. Peggy, every meal you make usually looks like it could be on a food menu. Yes, but I don't, like, when I say I don't take pride in it, like, I don't take pictures. I don't, like, make it like, oh, my God, this is so beautiful. Like, no. I don't take pride in my dinners anymore. I just don't care about it. <clears throat> Double chocolate. John, I, I love those, too. Try put them in, in the microwave for, like, 10 seconds. Just 10 seconds to get those donuts warm. Gives it a whole nother taste. Oh, with the crumble topping? Those are my favorite. I love the Edmund Zone. Like, the crumble. Oh, my gosh. Those Thank best. you, George. Hey, Jess here. <clears throat> so, does it make it make sense? I was skinny. Hit hurt to sit down. I thought I looked. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't understand. Hit hurt to sit down. Greetings from France. Hello, Sir Alex. Hello, Sir Alex. Bonjour. How are you? You know, someone complimented me on my headband tonight. I've made a handful of white headbands. This is the only one that I've worn more than once. The other ones I've made, I just doesn't don't like. Never come out right. I love food and I love cooking. Khaki, I admire your food. Well, thank you very much. See, I um, I love food, food too. I think about it all day long. Your recipe, amazing. Thank you. Um, I think about it all day long, and I think about combining food all the time. Wondering, uh, would it go? Does it make sense to go? Sometimes no, but I have a feeling it's gonna taste good. Thank Nine you, Jennifer. times out of ten, I'm right. Stop it. Thank you, Jennifer. Microwave is the best quick, the best fix. If someone gave me an ultimatum, said Jamie, one cooking appliance you could use. You want the stove or the or the um, or the microwave? I'd probably go with the microwave. Thank you, Melissa. It depends on what you're eating, though. Jamie, you know what I made for dinner tonight? Jimmy Jam's Delicious Sloppy Joe's. Paired next to air fry fried french fries. And I made some elote-styled roasted corn. Elote-styled corn. Hit the spot. Definitely sounds legit. delicious, Jimmy Jam. Now I gained 100 pounds. I no longer have guys hitting on me, and I can... Wear what you want. Guys don't hit on you because you gain weight. Is that what you're saying? <clears throat> if you're happy with what you what you did, like your transforma transformation, um, that's all that should matter. If you lost weight or put on weight because you wanted to, and guys are now not hitting on you, as long as you're happy, that's all that matters. Just haven't found the right guy, I guess. But if you're happy with the way you look, you should, there should be nothing wrong with that. <sighs> mm, however, I'm comfortable. I'm no comfortable. Oh, you're not comfortable in your own skin. I don't understand why I'm so confused right now. Lost weight, gained weight, now not comfortable in her skin. And guys are no longer hitting her, hitting on her in the gym. So, you want to lose weight, but you're having a hard time doing it. Right? In a nutshell, that's what it is.
Chucky, can you pass me a napkin? Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh my goodness. This is hitting me a lot quicker than it did last night. I'm going to have one more. I'm going to finish this slice and then I'm going to wrap it up. I'm tired. Mm. I'm tired and I'm confused. What are you confused about? I'm just tired and confused. I just need to go to bed. Tell them most guys are bums and losers. Don't empower them. Be happy being their best version of themselves and don't allow the standards of others to establish what your true value is. Jamie, you're my 80s bestie on Facebook. LOL. Thank you. Uh, when are you going to eat the cookies and ice cream? 4.30, 5 o'clock. I don't go into the dessert after dinner. I go to sleep and I wake up in the middle of the night. That's why I have a special designated area to do that. What are your love names for each other? Chico. For me. I mean, that's what I he call He always calls me Chico. I call her Chico mostly. I um, just call him Jamie. Yeah. <laughs> Chico and Jamie. That's about it. The Honey and Babe stuff stopped 10, 12 years ago. 13 years ago, maybe. No, it's not somebody rude. My mouth. 14 years ago. <laughs> we overdid it the beginning of our relationship. It wasn't anybody being rude. It was just somebody being weird. It was heavy. We were heavy, heavy, heavy lovey-dovey in the first, you know, year of our relationship. Yeah, we were like overdosing on the lovey-dovey crap. So. But now, you know what? I want the lovey-dovey crap to come back. <laughs> I would love it to come back. And we got the kids go. Ew. Ew. I don't care. Let them say ew. Let them say ew. I don't care. You just called her honey? I did? I called her Chico. He calls me Chico. First of all, if I heard honey, I would have been like, oh my god. Yeah, no, I called her <laughs> Chico. He called me Chico, not honey. <laughs> LOL. You called me your milk. <laughs> I probably did call you my MILF, and that's fine, Abby. You could be my MILF, too, even though you're, you're not a MILF. You can be a MILF, too. Still got to slap the caboose daily? I got my caboose slapped today in, in the store. Mm hmm By our daughter. Because she told me to race the shopping cart up so she could smack Daddy's butt. <laughs> Which when I did. you asked for a napkin, I didn't call her honey. I would know that. No, he did not call me honey. I know that for a fact. Went from honey and babe to baby daddy to hey yo. To, to hey bro. you dip. <laughs> Poop emoji to we should be civil. To bro. Get me a napkin. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Been calling each other for honey for 46 years. That's nice. Yeah. We're yeah. not against it. We just don't do it we anymore. We just don't do it. We, I, we never did it. Uh, You've, never call, did. You've never called me honey. Yes, I did. When? In the beginning of our relationship. Honey, babe, sweetheart. No, all you that call stuff. me babe. You never call me honey or sweetheart. First of all, I'm not sweet and I don't have a heart. Listen, you're about to be demoted <laughs> from Chico to bro. Listen, you're about to be promoted to bro no, to... No, I said demoted. Clean up my shit. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Miss you guys, bro. <laughs> Hello, Mickey. <laughs> He's a khaki. Can I have a napkin? You guys are going to tune in tomorrow night and see. I'm going to start calling her Doug. Who the hell is Doug? I'm going to call you Doug. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Did you get him, Munchkin? <sighs> Hello, Mickey. Favorite late night snack? Um, 
Like, not food, p uh, chips. Chips, probably. God, he called you, bro. You say, hey, sis. <laughs> oh. Can you imagine? I might. I just might, Jimmy Jam. Mm. This is better than the last lines for sure. I just have, I have like a whole cookie pie in me from this morning. I think that's what's doing a damper on my appetite. Uh, do I have another slice? Do I have another slice? I have another slice. I'm about to go eat some cake. What? I'm about to go eat some cake. Go ahead. I'm going to have another slice of pizza and then we're going to say goodnight. Ugh. I'm not a big cake guy. I tried many Quest Bars and I don't like them. The blueberry muffin one is good, Munchkin. Um, pop it in the microwave for seven seconds. It's I good. love shrimp tacos. Shrimp tacos happen to be my favorite. And that's all your wife eats? Oh, right, yes. Abby. I love shrimp tacos. Jamie, look, she ate more than five tacos. I got one taco left. I made seven tacos. Now you're going to have some chocolate cake. I am going to have some chocolate cake. Moose cake? Whatever kind of cake it was. Martha's birthday cake. My bad. I said you weren't going to eat it all. Technically, if you didn't eat the cake, you could eat it. So I was wrong. Um, yeah, I wouldn't go that far. You get dessert, Tommy. We get over your food. You just want cake. Are you over the tacos? Uh, I could eat the tacos still. But I could also eat cake. Yeah. And I do not plan to eat all of this cake. Uh -oh. Get down. Get down. I don't plan eating on all of this because this cake was sliced for Jamie and I. I don't want it. I know. I already knew you didn't want it and then your mom cut it for the both of us. Yeah, no. I have a cookie pie. That was for you. That was for me. But the heart, I wanted the flour, so. We both had a slice cut. Hey, Del. Thank you. Yeah, you guys that are saying goodnight, goodnight, we're ending it soon, too. I'm finishing this pie. Kaki's going to eat whatever she wants to eat from the cake. Then we're going to clean up and, uh, and go nighty-night. Hopefully there's a nice breeze in our room. Mm, I hope so, too. I don't want to have a hard time sleeping because it's hot. I don't think oh. it's going to be, but... I don't like the icing. No? Mm -mm. What don't you like about it? Mm -mm. Aftertaste? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> nope. There you go. Cat, don't forget to show Jamie my x ray. <laughs> Alright, I won't forget you. <laughs> did you text it to me? Because I'm pretty sure you did. <laughs> I'm afraid to open up right now. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Jimmy Jam texted me. <laughs> you're not so you're not eating it? No, I don't like the I don't right. like the icing. No. Mm -mm. I just texted it to you. You can see it now. It's healing. <laughs> oh good God. <laughs> see. And then we'll say goodnight. <laughs> It's an x-ray of a wiener. <laughs> this is perfect. <laughs> Jamie, do you smoke flour? I do. LOL. Just curious. Uh, no. Captain New Mexico, I'll show you what's up. My mouth, I would love to come to New Mexico. And I would love to take me here on your wine, freaking wine festival. I want to go. I want to go. 
Yeah, I don't smoke. Uh, I don't smoke that stuff. Jamie doesn't smoke anything. <laughs> Why well, vape? Va other than vape, <laughs> that's the only thing Jamie smokes is vape. But I don't like. Um... Khaki is that Merlot? Yes, yes, it is crazy. And you missed my tacos because you were late to the party. I had tacos. I bet the I now. bet the I bet New Mexican has the best tacos. LOL. No, Delaware actually has the best tacos. <laughs> Delaware is the state capital of the world of tacos. <laughs> you didn't know that? I don't know about that one. Yep, Delaware is known for their tacos. <laughs> Google it. We've only passed through Delaware, so I don't get that from. <laughs> mm. We never actually stopped in Delaware. I'm we not saying in my opinion. <laughs> Just saying, it's a fact. No, I saw Delaware Jamie. He looked too lonely last night. Yeah, he looked too lonely last night because my ass was in a freaking sushi coma. I went to a sushi coma, guys. It happens. Have you ever been to Delaware Munchkin? California has great tacos. I'm sure they do. My sister lived there. My brother lived there. They rave about the food. I'm sure your tacos are delicious. Because Delaware is a hidden gem of the tacos if you google it <laughs> united states taco state delaware you can think i'm playing around with you google it see what happens oh shit i wasn't planning on having another slice but I yeah might sushi well. coma is crazy yeah sushi coma crazy the sushi coma was at it it was on its own own other level like Khaki was I thought like, Khaki was drunk. Khaki That's was how like, much of a coma it was. He in. thought I was drunk. I didn't even drink freaking alcohol yesterday. I had nothing to drink yesterday other than freaking seltzer and water. And he's like, oh, you're drunk. And I was like, no, I'm not. I'm just tired. <laughs> I was just really tired. I just ate too much food to the point I was just like, <sighs> the minute that like I laid down on the couch, I knew it was over for me. I knew it was over because I was sitting at the table. And I knew, I was like, I was so tired to begin with, only because, like, I got up at, like, 6.15 in the morning <laughs> to get our, our kid ready for school. <clears throat> and then I exercised, and then, like, we ate dinner, and I was just like... <sighs> over 20,000 steps. I was done. I was done. I had over 20,000 steps. I purposely, purposely made sure... I exercised enough to eat what I was going to eat last night. <laughs> Purposely. Jamie seemed a little lost without you last night. I wasn't lost. It's just it's never the same when one of us is missing. I'm always I would here. seem lost if I'm Jamie always... wasn't here with me. If like <laughs> it was just me and no Jamie. I'm always like, here. But if, if I would have been lost too. Yeah. I wouldn't have known what to do. I would have been like staring you guys blankly like, hey guys, how's we, it going? We do this every, <laughs> we do this every single night together. So there are, and you know, if anybody knows anything about eating on camera, it can be difficult. Oh, it is difficult, to, especially to, if you're alone. If you're alone, to enjoy your food, keep the whoever's watching <laughs> entertained. Thank you, Sean Bully. The good I thing about that. doing this as a team is there's two of us, so one of us is eating, the other one is talking, and vice versa. Mm -hmm. It's like Stop an untold. It. Tag, Stop it. You know, Stop tag, it. tag in. When Khaki's eating, I'm talking. And then when I take a bite, Khaki starts talking or answering questions. Just how it is. Hello, Care Bear. Oh, give me that. Get down right now. All right. We'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm doing crunch backs. Crunch. Crunch backs. Crunch wraps. Crunch wraps. Mm hmm. Um, I was supposed to do crunch wrap with Jamie, but that was supposed to be tonight, so. Right. Tomorrow, oh. <clears throat> tomorrow will be crunch wraps. We'll see. Stop. All right. Good night, guys. Have a good night, guys. Mm -mm -mm -mm.